Good morning, Sri Lanka Sammy here. I'm out in front of my parents' house. This is my parents' house here, and this is our neighborhood. And there's construction next door here. And we have some new friends here. You don't want to get too close because you don't know what they will do. Wild cows. No, they're, they're domesticated cows. There's an empty lot next door to my parents' house. Uh, and they're letting the cows eat the grass there. But the problem with them is not only is the noise, because cows make, damn, they moo real loud, especially the mother, is their droppings. You gotta watch where you're walking. And uh, you gotta be careful and watch where you're walking. Can you hear that? That was just a baby. You should hear the mother. Oh my goodness, loud as heck. So anyway, I'm heading out into town today to do some shopping. So I thought I'd bring you along and check out what it is that uh, it looks like on a day, on a, on a walk to town. I gotta go to the bank, just take care of quick business. That noise there is a generator running in one of the houses next door, diesel generator, because there's a power cut today. And I talked about it in my last video about the power cuts. So uh, the government doesn't have money to buy fuel to power the power stations to provide electricity to the people. So they have to cut off the power for a few hours every day in different parts of the country. Anyway, so let's walk into town. Let's take a look around. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to walk up to the road pick up a tuk-tuk uh, and head into town. So it is Wednesday, election day in Korea. Hope everyone is safe and secure and voting. The other thing is that I noticed today as well is the reported numbers, 320, 350,000 people my gosh, that is a huge amount. Can you imagine the number of people who didn't get tested? <clears throat> because they're not uh, symptomatic. They may feel it and then say, ah, I'm just going to stay home, not bother. Man, that is some crazy, crazy stuff going on in South Korea. But anyway, it is, you would think it's like 12 noon here. It is 8.30 in the morning and it is hot like it is almost it is probably 30 32 degrees right now i am dying it's so hot that's why i had to get out of the house because the power cut off there's no fans i don't use air con i just need the air to move and there's no breeze today that's why i'm walking so i can get a little bit of a breeze so one of the things I want to pick up today is, is a battery powered fan. So at least I can have a little bit of air um, when the power goes out. So the other thing we did was, um, oh, nice breeze and nice shade. Um, one of the other things we did was yesterday, a guy came around, my parents called a company to come and put an estimate in on a solar powered battery backup system. My cousins have one at their home and it powers them all day if the power goes out. Now you can't run a microwave and a vacuum cleaner and you know run everything and air con and everything like that but you can have the fans and the lights on and my computer uh, for like you know the full day if needed but the power outages the most they've been is like five hours and on average, they're about two hours. So based on that and the power consumption that we're doing, it's probably going to last all day uh, with, with a full charge. Um, all it needs to do is last more than 12 hours, you know, overnight, because the sun here, I mean, just look at it. It's so powerful. Anyway, I'm at the road. I got to put on my mask. I don't wear a mask when I'm walking like this, but when I go out in public, when I get near people, I'll wear a mask. So 
I'll see you guys when I'm walking in the city. So here we are in a tuk the tuk tuk and I'm heading over to the, uh, I'm in town. So I live in a town called Chayala. Oh, the roads here are a little bit older. And it's pretty cool because I can speak Sigala. So, you know, I just asked the driver how to go, how much, and you know, where I want to go. And I he wasn't sure where to go, but I told him I know where to go. I did all in Sigalese. It was pretty cool, pretty quickly. So from a 10 minute ride, it cost me 150 rupees, which is about, uh, Seventy cents in a three-wheeler. Yeah, uh, one U.S. dollar is two hundred and thirty rupees, so I paid one hundred and fifty. Uh, I gotta learn the money thing, so that's that's the other problem here. I gotta start to recognize Korean, uh, not Korean, Sri Lankan uh, money as what its value is. Anyway, so I'm gonna head over there. We'll see you guys over there. It is hot, hot. It's only 9.30. So I had to go to the bank. I had to um, do a, a account confirmation for security purposes. So I just had to go to the bank to do that because I recently opened up my account. So yeah, I'm checking on that. And the other thing you gotta watch out for is you gotta watch out for traffic here. I'm not used to looking left and right because obviously they drive on the opposite side of the road here. So um, you gotta watch out for these buses right here. So there's two kinds of buses. There's the red bus and the white and uh, 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 white and blue buses. Sorry about that. I had to uh, take a phone call. Uh, as you can hear, all the generators are running because the power has been cut. So everybody runs their diesel generators. Um, today, uh, it's actually a different kind of power cut today. It's a power cut by the local power company to do maintenance. And these are the things that happen in a developing nation is you got to uh, be able to survive that. That's why, like I said earlier, we're, we're going to get solar power uh, battery backup set up in the house. So basically what I wanted to talk to everybody about today is just, you know, this is a little walkabout. What I do, what I have to do every day. Now I'm just going to pop into the... Um, um, my uh, internet provider. I'm going to pop into their office just to talk about their uh, online portal. Uh, I'm, I'm having trouble accessing their online portal. These are the things that I need to get like organized um, and set up to live here. These are the things that you got to do when you live 
uh, it, 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 in a place. But because I'm new, I have to set these things up once and set them up right so that, you know, I can live here. Once it's set up, I don't have to worry about it after that. So I'm over here at the uh, mobile store, not mobile, internet store, internet office. So I'm gonna go take care of that. I'll see you in a bit. So that is my adventure for today. Just walking around. Now, I'm not wearing a mask because I'm out in public, but as soon as I go inside a place, I put on my mask. Uh, there's no mask mandate here, uh, as far as I know. It's just what everybody does. Everybody does wear a mask, even in public, like in Korea. It's just too hot to wear one here. Um, and the numbers are really low. <laughs> Wow, dusty. So many. <coughs> so much dust. Uh, and diesel generators, too. I need to buy a fan. Yeah, crossing the street here is hell. Anyways, I need to buy a fan, so I'm just gonna go in the store and buy a fan. I'll see you guys in a bit. Yeah, so they didn't have a fan there. The other thing you gotta watch out for is walking. So, if you look at this, this is new but it's not even and in some places it's not paved now like I said I live in a um, rural area a small town and you know there's holes in the ground you really need to watch where you're walking number one for cow dung or whatever or garbage uh, number two is for holes in the road now you're wearing flip-flops I'm wearing flip-flops Wow, so many generators everywhere. Uh, yeah, you're wearing flip-flops, so, you know, those are not the most stable things in the world. So, you gotta double check where you're walking. Uh, I actually gotta go into this store, so I'll be right back. Yeah, so as I was saying, you gotta be careful where you're walking, gotta watch what you're doing. Traffic, stuff in the road, and the fact that the roads are not even so I've just taken to watching where I'm walking and walking slowly and pick up your feet anyway so one of the things I was doing today is because the power is out at my house there's really not much to do so I thought I'd come out and take care of some business and as I'm walking around I'm just looking at places and saying oh okay maybe I'll check that out in my neighborhood to see what's around what if I needed something in the future oh that's the store I go to because here it's not so much as um, you know online or getting things from coupon there are those types of things this is my favorite shop so they got all my favorite you know rotis and buns and things so this is Pereira and Sons. This is one of my favorite shops where I like to get a little roti bun, but kind of not in the mood for it today. I had a delicious breakfast that my mom made. And so it's only 10 o'clock. By the time I get home, there'll be lunch. Um, what I could do is with an ice cold Coca-Cola, which doesn't really exist. There's really no, in my neighborhood, there's really no 7-Eleven. 
Um, there's little mom and pop shops. All right, so like little roadside stands type thing. So, yeah. The other thing that I'm actually gonna look for is short term. As I mentioned before, someone's coming by to do um, a quote. Someone came by to do a quote on um, um, solar power. But what I'm going to do is see if I can get a um, diesel generator. Now, diesel fuel is hard to come by, but for those who have money, it's very easy. You just gotta pay for it. So, let you know that's the other thing I gotta figure out is uh, if we can if we can buy something like that. Oh, crap! I should have stayed on that side of the road. I keep forgetting where I am. Not forgetting. It's just remembering which side of the road to be on because I gotta cross like two or three times. So, let's cross now. Alright, so, anyway, I'm gonna finish up the, the video today and just say thank you to everyone who's watching, liking. This is the lineup for the gas station. So, that's why there's a lot of traffic. So, as you can see, this, this is the lineup. It goes for about another half kilometer this way. And the... It's just a huge lineup, a couple of hours just for gas. So I will cross the road to the other side because this is ridiculous on this side. Yeah, this is the traffic. And I'm right in front of a gas station. There's nobody in the gas station because the gas station has no gas. So, I will see you guys later. Is the Itaewon Sammy, King of Kangnam, King of Kangnam, Sri Lanka Sammy, saying, talk to you guys soon. Be well.